And now to some hissing under the hood of a car that had a driver in for a slithery surprise. The car's check engine light came on, but when they popped the hood, they found the last thing they would ever expect to see. Seven's Franklin White has the story. No, it's okay. He's not coiled to strike. It was a big snake. It's a slithery and slimy surprise. That thing had a girth of about seven inches. A massive and surprisingly mellow Burmese python found lying underneath the hood of a car. Yeah, look at that. FWC telling us a snake sighting happened just before 10 Thursday morning near Tiger Trail Boulevard in Dania Beach after someone at this shop noticed its blue Mustang's check engine light was on. When that person opened the hood to fix the problem, this was lying curled up inside. That's when they ran next door to ask Gerard DeFay for help. I thought, OK, I'll go and help them. I'll yank it out from under the hood of their car. I wasn't expecting that python underneath the hood of the car. He says he wasn't frightened and immediately jumped in and helped first responders wrangle it. He grabbed it by the back of the head. He started pulling it towards him, and I saw an opportunity to help him get it out from underneath the sway bar. So, uh, yeah, we grabbed it out. By that time, it was around his hands. I had to help pull his hands out from inside the coils. And uh, we tried putting it in the bag three or four times. Eventually, it took four people. After that, it was wrapped up and taken away. And because we're told the car was sitting outside overnight, he believes a snake snuck in from this nearby lake that's just feet away. And now he's hoping this is a wake-up call for anyone living or working nearby. I think that there are going to be possibly a lot of dogs and cats going missing in residential areas because they're obviously getting closer. So as for where the python came from officially, we don't know. And if you do see a snake like that, call FWC immediately. Reporting at Daniel Beach, Franklin White, Today in Florida.